Thieves ransack a Soulsville community center just weeks away from its grand opening, tearing the place apart and stealing valuable equipment. Hello, I'm Greg Hurst. It's almost back to square one. I'm Stephanie Skurlock. A project designed to help the community is nearly destroyed. WREG's Bria Jones joins us live from outside that center with a look at the damage and Bria some plans to try and get the program back on track. That's right, Greg and Stephanie. The executive director says she went away for a vacation and came back to find out someone broke into the church and went through this locked gate into the community center. Take a look this video inside the new Soulsville USA Community Arts and Economic Empowerment Center looks like the aftermath of a destructive tornado, but instead vandals are to blame. It really is just unfathomable. Benicia Kembro, director of the River Region Community Development Corporation, says Wednesday when preparing for an inspection, she found the building had been broken into. Months of hard work was down the drain. They took the kitchen equipment, so the stoves, the refrigerator, the microwave, all of the tables, all of the chairs. Leaving behind Easter eggs and this Bible. She says the thieves also took bathroom and ceiling tile, toilets and two air conditioning units, even trashing the church in front. The amount of damage that was done um, for something that's on holy ground and there was just no regard. This is what the facility looked like before, ready to offer free services to the community. A youth arts, cultural arts program. So in addition, we would have offered free legal services uh, for community members, in particular, uh, small business owners. And this is what it looks like now, after thieves caused $300,000 in damage. Kimbro says the setback may delay the opening of the building for six months, but she's still planning to roll out summer activities for the youth. Yet and still, we're going to get our porta potties and we're going to put us a tent up and we're going to do exactly what we intended to do. Kimbro says right now there is no surveillance video, but the thieves did leave behind fingerprints and DNA collected by police. She's offering a $1,000 reward for any information. If you know anything, call Crime Stoppers at 528 Cash. For now, reporting live in Soulsville, Bria Jones, WREG News Channel 3.